Well hi folks, it's April the 1st now and it's not a joke but usually I'll be uh, showing you everything I've been sowing and planting I'd usually have my peas sown in there and lettuces direct sown and beetroot and everything but because of the weather this year as you can see I've been having to dig my plot out of the snow and it's still got snow on it and it's still freezing cold so there's nothing going on at all so it's the latest I've ever left it before I've planted anything ever in my life so I should have my onions in and everything but still everything's under snow like I say I've dug this bit out so that should melt hopefully and dry out because where it's where the wind's getting on it it's drying out and the soil's in really good uh, really good fettle now you know it's just perfect for planting stuff but it's it's just too cold so need to be patient in this game unfortunately I've learned that over the years if you start sticking things in now they just rot and die because they just they don't grow so like I say everything's still pretty much covered in snow it's not melting because it's in the north facing bit so same thing in the polytunnel I'm just going I usually have all my onions in here growing away by now my big exhibition ones but uh, not a thing growing, it's all just covered up with plastic to try and warm the soil up. Same as ever. Nothing growing. And even the, the potatoes, I put some potatoes in pots nearly a month ago. Not a dicky bird, not even a sprout. So, like I said, there's no point in growing stuff early when it's freezing cold. There's nothing happens whatsoever. So it's a bit depressing at the moment. I'm just hoping it'll warm up soon. Under there is uh, some bushes, I think. Whether they've been flattened or not, I don't know, but uh, we will see. Last year, my, my rhubarb was all firing away after we'd had that really hot spell. And that's the extent of it this year. Pitiful, absolutely pitiful. Still dormant, just about breaking dormancy now. So everything's the same, just bare soil everywhere, nothing's growing. I know I sound like I'm moaning, but I'm getting a bit fed up with it now. On to my other bit, which has all been sort of tilled, ready for planting. Nothing again. I'm going to plant all my onion sets in this bit. I've got some garlic in there. But that's not broken surface. And I've got actually one purple sprouting broccoli head. It's absolutely enormous. And I would have had a lot more, if you can see. But like I said before, the mice got to it when they were younger and just chewed all the chewed all the buds off ruined it otherwise I'd have had a really good crop so like I say nothing going on still freezing cold still snow on the ground in April which I've never seen before so we'll just have a quick look at the pond I'm just wandering up to the pond now we had some hellish snow drifts around here and it's still still deep that's where I've been filming all my stuff with the sort of wildlife camera you can get down here without falling in check that out for a snow drift Unbelievable, isn't it? Look at it. April the 1st and you've got six foot snowdrifts still. So anyway, that's where it all happens, the wildlife thing. Nothing exciting, but it's amazing what sort of stuff we get. So that's about it, folks. April the 1st, still nothing growing. Never known it as late as this to be planting stuff. Or not even planting stuff, so... I'll just have a quick zoom in on Ingleborough as usual. In all her resplendent, snowy beauty. So that's about it, folks. Hopefully we'll get some stuff planted by May. See you later.